almost spit it there. So <laughs> I have uh, just a few more minutes to, uh, to cover some things, and, uh, and then we will wrap up and, uh, and get you all out of here and, and onto the event. Um, you know, we talked about super users, and uh, super users have tools. You know, super users on, on systems, they have utilities that allow them to, uh, to, to do things and uh, perform actions and, and make changes in those systems. And I think that from our perspective, you know, we feel like um, we've had a lot of progress in the development community, and the developers have uh, infrastructure and tooling and processes, and we want to start to introduce some of those on the, on the user side um, as well. And some of these things have, have kind of been in progress for a little while. Um, you may remember that we, uh, we actually printed a book starting last year that was written by a number of operators of OpenStack, the OpenStack Operations Guide. We have some other books that are coming out from O'Reilly. And uh, um, we started some other things. Uh, Troy mentioned that we did an operators meetup in March in California. We have the ops meetups, meetups happening here this week. Um, there's also another session on Wednesday. We've talked a lot about software and development and kind of that forward thinking, the future of, uh, of, of the industry. But at the same time, there are a lot of enterprises who are making use of OpenStack. And, uh, and there's a session on Wednesday. It's at 2 p.m. It's in uh, B407, up a couple escalators here, um, that is going to be focused specifically on um, on things that we can do inside of OpenStack to make it more enterprise ready. So if that's something that interests you, please you know, go to that as well. Um, and then through this week, we have a number of different ways that you can start your journey to becoming a super user if you aren't already. Uh, there's a, uh, a booth up the escalators just right out here that has a number of stations where you can start to sign up for some of the mailing lists, join the community, um, provide survey feedback on OpenStack, and, uh, and we actually have some of these books there that we're giving away if you'd like to have a copy of the OpenStack Operations Guide. And so you know, we're trying to give you opportunities to, to start your journey as a super user this week. In addition to that, though, we want this to be something that goes on well past the summit. And one of the other things that we are, are launching today is a new online publication, OpenStack Super User, that is built um, for operators, it's by operators. Most of the contributors are users and, and operators of OpenStack clouds. The editors are. And, uh, and it's really going to dive into issues around running OpenStack, but also, I think just as importantly, the kinds of organizational issues that people run into as they try to bring this change into their companies. And, uh, and so this is, I think, something that's going to be exciting and, uh, and valuable. And, and this is available at superuser.openstack.org. Um, with uh, quite a bit of content already up there. Now, this is something that we're just getting started, and uh, we want your help, we want your involvement, we want your feedback on uh, what we can do to make this very valuable for you. So please check it out and, uh, and, and let us know how you want to be involved and, and what you want to, uh, to see there. I showed this slide earlier. These are the, the sponsors from the summit, and that's a lot of companies. <laughs> One of the great benefits of OpenStack is this ecosystem. You know, it, it gives you many on-ramps to, uh, to taking advantage of OpenStack. But at the same time, you know, that can be overwhelming. And one of the number one questions that we hear at the foundation is, how do I get started? You know, where do I go to get OpenStack in my environment? And so one of the other tools that we are introducing today, it's a new tool to help navigate that ecosystem. And so we are launching openstack.org slash marketplace today. And this is a section of our website that's really oriented around the paths to adoption. So if you would like to consume OpenStack on an hourly basis as a service, it lists out public clouds. If you would like to have someone help you build a private cloud implementation, there are services and consulting companies. If you're looking for a distribution, there are, uh, are um, lists of the, the distributions that are available, appliances that are available. And this is, uh, is really meant to be a resource to help people find their way into OpenStack and, and uh, be able to get the most use out of it. We, we launched kind of a, a smaller version of this 
uh, about seven or eight months ago that was focused on training. Because one of the number one pieces of feedback that we heard is that people needed a way to educate themselves or educate their teams on OpenStack. And since we launched that, it was, uh, you know, again, it was a, a fairly small start, but it has ramped up. And the, uh, the organizations that have offered training through the marketplace have delivered over 250 training sessions in 30 countries in six months. And so, you know, that's a lot of, uh, a lot of OpenStack education happening all around the world. And, and that's the power of this ecosystem. So we are expanding the marketplace today, and, uh, and it's going to continue to grow. You know, this is, again, just the start. Uh, and I'm, I'm really excited to, uh, to see how, uh, how this plays out and, and grows over time. In addition to the online marketplace, we, uh, we wanted to, to bring that here in person. And one of the things that I think is interesting, you, know, you, you heard um, the, the keynotes from Rackspace and Dell, and they talked a lot about working in this ecosystem. And the OpenStack ecosystem is, I think, an interesting environment. Uh, it's kind of like a farmer's market in a way. You, know, you go to a farmer's market, and you can buy things in different formats. You can get ingredients to go make your meal. You can buy pre-made meals. You're going to make a choice between those options there. But at some level, the vendors who participate in that farmer's market, they have a common goal. You know, it may be locally sourced, maybe organic. They have something that, that is, uh, is binding them together. And that's really, I think, what we see in OpenStack. We have companies who are out there competing in the marketplace and, uh, and who are um, you know, delivering services. But at the same time, they come here to this summit. Their developers go to the design summit. They collaborate. They work together. And so you know, our, our companies compete, but they also collaborate to build the best technologies for the benefit of the whole industry. And so this is really the theme behind our, um, our expo hall this time around. It's, uh, it's, you know, we have the online marketplace, and we have lo the live and in-person OpenStack marketplace, which as you walk out of here, um, it's just next door over this way. And it, it was a pretty cool build out. So we actually took some time-lapse video, because you know, time-lapse video is a lot of fun to watch. Um, so let's, let's just roll that and see us putting that together over there. So our sponsors are over there. It's, it's really exciting. I love that flyover footage at the end. Our, our uh, crew actually has a drone with a camera on it. I asked them if, uh, if we could bring that in here and fly it over the audience and get some over, overhead shots. And they said our insurance would not like that. So, However, we, uh, we also, you know, we've got the physical marketplace. We have the online marketplace. They, uh, they did put together a, a, a quick time lapse video of building the online marketplace as well. Let's, let's look at that. OK, not, not quite as exciting. <laughs> so um, the marketplace is over there. And uh, um, there's going to be a, a, a booth crawl and happy hour this evening. There's a game. If you get the guidebook app on your phone, um, you take some snapshots of QR codes um, to try to figure out a phrase. If you figure it out and you tweet it, you have an opportunity to win a trip to our Paris summit. So you get, you get access to the summit. You get uh, your hotel room there. And, uh, and I think that's you know, pretty exciting to, uh, to have. Um, so you know, the, the marketplace is, I think, going to be a, a great thing for, for people who are getting started with OpenStack. That wraps it up for, uh, for today. I, um, I'm really excited to have everyone here. You know, go explore the show, attend the sessions, get educated, get connected, meet people. It's going to be a great week. And thank you so much for being here and joining our community.